Hey guys, I'm back with another Timu haul today. I got quite a few items and I wanna go ahead and show you guys what I got so I can put everything away and start enjoying it. Um, I got my kids a bunch of stuff, but I've already given it all to them. I do have Gracie's little dolls that I bought her, so I'll show you guys that, but she's already been playing with them. The order came in yesterday, which was June 14th, I wanna say. Um, and she's already been playing with them, so they don't have the little bows on the top of their head anymore. Um, but this one, it's called the Fashion Doll Princess Suit for Girls, and it's 17 centimeters by 6.69 inches, and this one was $2.98. I hope you guys can see her. They have the cutest little faces ever. This one is the pink one. And then, like I said, she had, um, she had a little pink bow in her hair, but Gracie's already taken it out. It was like up here. And it was really cute because the bows are like little hair breadths that you can actually put in your kid's hair. So there's the first one. And then the next one is the yellow one. It's called the same thing, but it's just a different color. They had like four or five different colors. And there's this one and she's in a yellow dress with a butterfly, and she had a little yellow bow. And this one was cute. This one is called the Mermaid Princess Doll Gifts 6.3 inch doll. And this was, I paid $4.48 for it. Now keep in mind, just because I paid that for it doesn't mean that you will. Their prices are constantly going up and down on the items. That is the reason why when you place an order with Timu, for 30 days after you placed your order, you can go back to your orders and keep checking them multiple times a day and you can get price adjustments. There'll be an option for a price adjustment and if you click it, they will give you what the difference is and they'll add it to your Timu account for a credit balance towards future orders. So it's really cool. Um, here's the Little Mermaid one. This one is super pretty. She's got a little crown on her head and a little sequin dress. She's got little braids in her hair and then here's her, the bottom of her, her tail. This one is so pretty. Look at her little eyes. They're so cute. And her crown. So those are the dolls that I got Grace. Okay, the next thing I got my teenagers, but unfortunately my daughter couldn't wear hers because she has a, a thinner They're face. They're more for like fuller faces. So I actually kept them and gave her a pair of the ones I already had, which I didn't get from Timu. Um, I ordered them from Amazon, but these are the blue light glasses. Kind of dirty now, but um, they're called men's blue light blocking clear flat glasses and they were $1.68 and I got her the blue because her favorite color was blue or is blue. And then I got my son black. And here's what they look like since these are mine now. And like I said, keep in mind that if you have a thinner, um, face, then you may have a hard time keeping these on. They may be a little bit too big. And those were $1.68. I don't know if I told you that or not. <laughs> okay, next are my rings that so I got. So this one is a cross ring and it's called Elevate Your Look with this stunning gold something. I can't see the rest of it, but it was $1.67 and it is really pretty. I'm very picky with my rings. I don't like really cheap looking rings and especially if they have like the rhinestones in them that look like diamonds or something. They can't have like the spaces between them as they're like set down in the setting because to me it just looks like it come from a bubble gum machine and I don't want that. So I'm very picky with how they look, but this was $1.67. I don't know if you guys can see, and it doesn't look like that at all. It actually looks like a really expensive ring and it sets pretty flat on your finger and I just really like it a lot. So there's that one. This one was a free gift. You know how when you go to Timu, sometimes little things will pop up as soon as you open the app and it'll say, oh, you got this coupon bundle or that coupon bundle. Well, I've been getting the ones that pop up that say, if you order within a certain amount of hours, they give you a decent amount of hours, like 24 hours or something like that, then they will give you a free gift. Well, it just so happened one day I signed on to place my order because I like to go through Timu sometimes browse and add stuff to my cart. And then when I'm ready to place the order, I go buy it. Well, I got on to do that one day and I got the pop-up saying, here's a free gift if you order within like 18 hours or whatever. So they literally let you pick through thousands of things and you can get it for free. And that's what I did with this ring. Um, I wanted it for free because I was afraid that it was gonna look cheap 
and weird. So, and I, but it looks so pretty in the picture. And I saw other people that had bought it that had like pictures of it, but the pictures were kind of blurry and stuff. But I was like, well, if it's free, then I could get it. And if it's not, then I'm not really out anything. But it actually turned out to be really cute. And it looks like this. And it's just like this big, clear um, crystal ring. It does have the baguettes. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's trying to focus on me on each side of it. And it's just really pretty and clear. And like I said, this one was free. And when I clicked on it to see what the price was to tell you guys, if you just wanted to order it, it was already sold out. So I'm sure it will come back because I've actually seen that ring before through other distributors on Timu. So I'm sure you can still find it on there, but I can't, I don't know what the name of it was. Okay, the next one is a bow ring. And I actually had this in my cart for a long time and I wasn't gonna buy it. And then I changed my mind one day and I'm like, you know what, no, I'm gonna buy it. It's really cheap. When I say cheap, I mean inexpensive. I'm country, that's my way of saying it. Um, I don't even know where it's at. Oh, this was one of those things that I added to my cart after I placed the order. Within a certain amount of time before they package your order, you can keep shopping and it'll give you the option instead of add to cart, it'll say um, something like, basically you're adding it to your order and it will just charge you again for that item that you're adding. And that's what I did with this. But this was only 71 cents and it is really cute. It is a bow. And it looks just like a mystic topaz. You see how like all of the colors change and shift from green to purple. There's some yellow in there. And then you got the rhinestones around it. This one is still on Timu. It is all over the place on Timu. And it is really inexpensive. It is under a dollar and it is really pretty and I love it. So I'm glad I got that one. And then the last one, I love the color of the stone. It looked really cool to me. Um, see how much I paid for it before I show you guys. There it is. It's called Gorgeous Green Zircon Ring. And it was $1.88. And this one is so pretty. It looks like, I don't know if you guys can see well, because there's a glare. But it looks like shattered glass or something in the middle. And... The profile is so pretty on this ring. But I loved it. It's so pretty. The color is so unique. I don't have a ring like this. So, yeah, I really like this. And like I said, $1.88 for this ring. Okay, that is all the I rings. I got a ton of phone cases in this order, guys, because I just recently got a new phone, as I told you guys in my last Timu haul. And I had to start all over with my phone cases. So, I got a lot. Okay. I've been wanting this for a while, too. This was actually in my cart for at least a couple of months. And I didn't buy it. But I really wanted it this time. I love it. It's so pretty. It's a lot prettier in person than what I thought it was going to be. I'm still trying to find how much it was. $0.87. Cents, and it's called the Elegant Flower Hair Accessories for Women. And it's this really pretty tulip clip and these teeth are strong so if you got thick hair this is gonna hold your hair it is so pretty look at the detail on it 88 cents you can't go wrong with that you can't go to the dollar tree and buy this kind of stuff y'all know we're all about a budget here so yeah highly recommend this Ooh, it's like metal and yeah it's really sturdy I like it a lot. I can't wait to like pull my hair back with it. I think it's gonna look so cute in my black hair. Like it just pops, I love it. Okay, I'm just gonna pull stuff out of the bag randomly. <laughs> I needed these so bad Ugh. because I never had them. And when I saw them on Timu, I was like, oh my gosh, what a nifty little contraption. But these are the scissors that you trim your eyebrows with. If I can get it to focus. It's trying to focus everywhere. But like scissors and then you that has a comb on it. So you're basically just like combing them up. And then as you comb up, it clips them. You can clip them at the same time. And this was 68 cents for these. So 
Good deal. Good deal. All right, next, um, I wasn't sure how their nails was. Everybody's in love with those Impress nails by Kiss. They have gorgeous designs, but at the same time, I've had no luck with them. They used to be like so bendy and like bend every time you touch something. And then years later, I tried them again recently and they just kept popping off. I couldn't get them to stay on for any more than like half a day. So I won't buy those. I must be doing something wrong because everybody else is just having such good luck with those. But mm. so I was worried about kind of trying nails from Timu. But um, after getting these, I'm gonna order more because these are really good quality nails. These were, let's see if I can, you guys look at it while I'm, these were a dollar sixteen, and these are called the gorgeous pink and white spotted coffin ballerina. Just type in all that, and I'm sure it will come up. That's all I can see. But these were a dollar sixteen, and they're just hot pink with little hearts. And then I don't know why my camera's not focusing well. And that glare is killing us. Little light. Uh, pink polka dots and stripes and they're just so cute. Okay, next we're going to get into some, well, what is this? Oh, I haven't even looked at this one yet. I opened this stuff yesterday, but I didn't open this, but I want to see it. This is called the Handheld Makeup Mirror Lipped Shaped Vanity and it was 87 cents. So we're going to look at it together. Still in the bag. And I got this to go in my makeup bag because I saw the reviews and I knew, like the picture looks like, makes it look like it's really big, but it's not. And when I saw the other people buying it, I looked at their pictures and saw that it was small. And I was, they also had a blue one and I think gray. But um, I thought it would be so cute to put in my makeup bag because the only thing I'm using for my makeup bag is my compact. It's got that little tiny mirror and you girls getting old, my eyes aren't that great. So it looks like this. It's literally not that big. And I'm gonna turn this around even though it's probably gonna blind y'all. But there's what the mirror looks like. It's a really good mirror. It's not like one of those mirrors that looks like a fun house mirror or anything. It's a legitimate mirror. You guys can see yourself. So yeah, this was pretty cute for 87 cents. Heck yeah. All right, now we're gonna get some phone cases. And I'll probably go through these kind of quick because I'm not sure if you guys are really too interested in these. Um, they have all kind, you can get the, the cases I'm gonna show you if you like any of them. You can, you can definitely find them in your phone, what size you need, because they had a whole list of different phones that, for each phone case that I picked. So, if you like any of mine, guaranteed you're gonna find your phone, if it's not the same phone I have, in the list of phones too, so. This one says, I probably should have left that thing in it. This one is the Transparent Coffee Milk Tea phone case. And this was $1.28. And it just has little coffees. And it looks like, it says, but first coffee. It also says latte, coffee latte. It has little coffee cups, coffee beans, um, donuts little splashes, what looks like splashes of coffee all over it. It's really cute. Okay, next I got this for my earrings because I have so much jewelry, but I haven't been wearing it all. Like I'm trying to get it to the point where I'm like more minimal with everything and just have like very few select pieces that are like good quality that I just wear all the time because I'm not into these big old earrings sometimes I like bigger hoops rarely but sometimes I don't really change my necklaces too much like I was gonna show you guys this too because I didn't get to show you guys this this is a necklace that I got from Timu and it you were able you could get it customized and you can get it with your name I didn't want my name so I got the initial of all of us so I got um his initial, my initial, my oldest daughter, my son, and then my youngest daughter and his youngest son. Everybody's initials and I wear it and it's stainless steel and I've had this thing for a month. I never take it off. I take a shower in it and everything. And as you guys can see, it hasn't turned. It is still gorgeous. I absolutely love it. So that's my point is to get like a few select pieces. 
and have them organized in little containers and get rid of all the other random nonsense that I don't even wear anymore. Um, and I might be selling some of that stuff online. I'm looking for a good place to sell it, but I just don't know where. I looked at, at like Depop, but it looks like that's mostly for clothing. I don't know. You guys let me know where would be a good place to sell like secondhand stuff. Um, I would probably do payment through PayPal or something like that. Um, you guys let me know if you have any ideas about that. But anyway, I got this container. Running my mouth. It was 58 cents. And it is my plan to put all of my little earrings in here. So it would be so much easier for me to keep this in my desk drawer right here and just open it every morning and pick out the earrings that I want to wear because I don't wear any bigger than like this most of the time. These are like real sterling silver with diamond chips that I ordered from Amazon years ago. Okay, so <laughs> these are kind of funny. Y'all don't laugh at me. These are some stickers. I don't even know if you guys know this about me or not. I am really into Bigfoot. I do think he exists. I cannot wait to one day go Bigfoot hunting. Um, I love Bigfoot. So they had stickers of Bigfoot on Timu and this is the 100 pieces outdoor Bigfoot stickers. These were $1.79 and it is my plan to make me a phone case that's Bigfoot thing because I have a clear phone case and um, they, they don't just have Bigfoot. They have Bigfoot stickers in this pouch and then just camping stickers in this pouch. And I love camping. It's like one of my favorite things to do. As a matter of fact, we'll go camping either at the end of July or beginning of August and I can't wait. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you guys some of these things. I can get the package open. And these are like really good quality stickers. They were $1.79 for 100. This one, is one of my favorites already because it's Bigfoot and he's carrying one of my favorite foods, which is a flipping taco. So that's probably definitely going on my phone case. Then we have a bunch of aliens, which I'm not crazy about. So probably won't use those. This one's pretty cool. It's a silhouette of Bigfoot in the woods. This one kind of looks like the, what is that? The champion look, not the champion. I don't know. NBA logo. I don't know, but it's Bigfoot, his silhouette. Then we got this Bigfoot doing the dab. Isn't that what it's called? All the kids doing the mm, thing. Yeah, there you go. Then we got this one and just some other ones like this. I'll go through them kind of fast. This one, if you're in Florida, your Bigfoot's called the skunk ape. So this one says a Florida skunk ape on it. And this one says beer. He's carrying beer. I'm not too crazy about that one either, but whatever. This one I like. It just says believe. And it's Bigfoot. I love that one. Bigfoot playing an electric guitar. <laughs> this one called El Squacho. Yeah, so there's those. I won't show you guys no more because I'm sure you guys are already tired of looking. And then we got the camping ones. Which... I don't know what these look like. Just some random camp themed stickers. Ooh, I like this one. It's a Jeep. So if you got a Jeep, there you go. Here's your little fire and your cup of hot chocolate or something. This is Adventure. Your wolf howling. Ooh, Tim would like that. I will give that to my son. He loves the wolves. This one's pretty, enjoy the view. Anyway, those are the camping ones. Next we're gonna look at, oh, these tattoos, which these were kind of disappointing because to me, it looked like there was more that came with 47 it. 47 cents, and it looked to me like you got multiple sheets, but it was just one sheet. And I really like these because they look so real because of the shadows and stuff. So I got these temporary tattoos. I thought that would be cute for me and my older daughter and my younger daughter to put on. And this one I'm gonna to have to send back, unfortunately. Or get a refund or have them send me another one or something. And it really sucks because I was really looking forward to this, this phone case. So this was the Grumpy Bear Care Bear. He's my favorite. 
and it was a dollar for eight, 48 and it says cute bear printed soft TPU phone case. It's a clear phone case and it just has grumpy bear on it. But as you can see, grumpy bear's face has peeled. And it looks to me like it might've been some type of tab because look at the shape that it peeled. So I'm not really sure what happened there, but I'm gonna have to contact Timu. And I, honestly, I would just like to have another one because I'm sure that was just a fluke, but um, it was $1.48. So I'm gonna contact them about that and see if I could return it to them or just have them send me another one because I don't want to refund. I, I like this case, so I want it. All right. Next is this. I actually got my daughter a blue one of these. Where is it at? This is called... How do I open this? This is called the Transparent Flower Pattern Square Makeup Bag. This is called the Transparent Flower Pattern Square Makeup Bag. And I got my oldest daughter a blue one of these because her favorite color is blue. And I thought they were going to be bigger, but they're they're a decent size. And they're really like, they're really soft. It's hard to explain. It's kind of like a shower cap, maybe. Texture, <laughs> whatever you call it. But um, I'm not sure what I'm going to use this for. It was 99 cents. Um, her blue one was only 59 cents. So a lot of the times when they have different colors like that, they'll be cheaper if it's a certain color. But anyway, so this is, I wanted one of these because I think it'll really help when I straighten my hair. And I wanted it for my purse because I don't want to carry like a big brush in my purse. This little sucker is called the One Piece Plastic Foldable Hair Comb travel portable and it just keeps going. I'm, I'll read you guys what I can see. Um, this was 89 cents. They did have different colors. It looks like this. And you open it up and you got your comb and you got your brush. So this would be nice to keep in your purse because it's so tiny. Phone case. This phone case, I actually got two colors in this phone case. This is called the Crystal Clear Protection Card Holder Phone Case. And it was 88 cents. And it is pink. It's got a ripped paper behind it. So I thought the phone case was messed up. But it is silicone. And it's got this little slot where you can put your cards. So you don't have to take a purse or anything like that with you when you go out. If you're just running to the grocery store. Because I hate carrying my purse when I'm just running out real quick. And I hate putting my cards in my pocket because I'm so afraid that somebody's going to reach in my back pocket and grab them or something. I don't want to put them in my bra because boob sweat is a thing. And I got a phone case. I like this one. Okay, this one was really inexpensive. I f that was 88 cents if I forgot to take that. I specifically got this phone case because it was so simple and it was so inexpensive. This was 29 cents and it's called the silicone mobile phone case, full body protection. It is a basic black silicone case. And up here around the camera, it says pro camera, just a black case. Next case is just like the pink one I just showed you, but it was the, it's the other color. This one um, is in the green but it was a prettier green. I normally don't like green, but this looked like a really pretty, like different color green and I love it. This was 88 cents as well. This one was the one that I was most excited to get, but was kind of not a letdown, but it wasn't as pretty in person as they made it look online, even though it's still a really pretty phone case. This one is called the Flower Graphic Printed Phone Case, and it looks like this. I got it because it looks so like shabby chic, and that's my thing. 
Um, it's really pretty. It's got pink flowers and the little like lattice down here. This was $1.98. This one I got as a reminder to myself because sometimes I have a hard time of accepting me for who I am. And it causes me stress. <laughs> um, this one is called, maybe if I can find it. This one is called Love Heart Pattern Design Shockproof Slim, probably phone case, $1.48. And it just says, it's a pink, and it says, be yourself. And then around the camera, it says, beloved. And around the sides, it says, beloved. So I really like this one. It's cute. It'll look good on my phone because I got the silver iPhone 14 Pro Max. Therefore, the back of it looks white. I got a bunch of these tiny little rubber bands. They were inexpensive. Um, for my hair because I'm going to start doing things with my hair other than just leaving it hang. A dollar, or 71 cents for a thousand of these. You can't beat that. These are so cute. I can't wait to wear these. These are little crosses. They're called sparkling cross shaped zircon hoop earrings. They were $1.78. Oh man, do I hope you guys can see them. And they're tiny little hoops. They're so cute. So cute. The other one's right there. Obviously, there's two. So, there's that. We're just down to a bunch of little stuff now, guys. I don't know if there's another phone case in there or not. Okay, these were one of those things that I just added to my cart after I shopped because I just kept looking. And I saw these and I'm like, oh my gosh, they're so cute. So I can't really give you guys the name. I'm sorry. Because I don't know what they're called. When I was buying the bow ring that I showed you guys, um, these came up too. And I thought, oh my gosh, those would match. Those kind of match the bow ring. So I bought these. And they were really inexpensive too. I think they were only about, I think they were like 60 cents or something. They look like this. They have that kind of... They have a really high quality looking like hook. And then they also look like mystic topaz with the shift and the purple. And then you could see the profile. They're just really pretty and they're not big. Like I said, I don't like big. I'm not a fan of big earrings. My God, do I have makeup on? I told y'all I just got home from work. Anyway. Oh, I do have another phone case. Now this one, I'm not sure how, about, how I feel about this and what I'm going to do about it yet. Um, I haven't really looked at it enough to know if I like it, but this was not the phone case I ordered at all. I'll probably go ahead and keep it and just order, try to order again. I would hate to get the same one again. But um, this was supposed to be, I'll show you in a minute what it was supposed to be. I paid $1.48 for it regardless but this is not the phone case similar but not it so here's the phone case i got it is pink it is leopard and it's like mirrored back and it's got these little scalloped edges and it was a dollar 48 but that's not the phone case it was supposed to be it was supposed to be this one i don't know if you guys can see that whole phone case is pink. It is not mirrored. It does not have the scalloped edges. That is the phone case I wanted. That is not the phone case I got. But it's still cute. I'll probably still keep it. I don't know if I'll chance it again to try to order the one I really wanted or not. But okay, so I got these to go over my hair too. These are called the three-piece chiffon print triangle headband women you get three of them, three colors. And the first one, it, it just has the little elastic like this, it stretches. And then you put it over your head and it hangs over the back of your head like a band. It has like the triangle to where it goes over the back of your head. But this, the print was so pretty in these and they're like so like smooth and I just, I can't wait to wear these. 
this one's my favorite because it's like a baby pink and it's got these flowers on it. Just like, I don't know, when you're going out real quick or when you're cleaning house or something to keep your bangs out of your face. And here's a dark blue one. Look how pretty those are. And like I said, these stretch pretty big. So these were a dollar seven for three of those. Next, I needed this so bad. I needed it so bad. If I can open it. Don't know how to open it. Basically, this is just a silicone um, face mask spreader. Like you could use it if you're for putting on a face mask. They had different colors. I got the pink just silicone you can spread your face mask this was 44 cents and it has like a little spoon on this side to where you can get it out really handy okay so this next item is a, it says a pair of 925 silver fashion simple water drops now these are really pretty i highly doubt they're sterling silver normally i can tell they're stamped 925 I'm pretty good with jewelry. I've always had an obsession with jewelry and I could pretty much spot a fake. And especially when it comes to gemstones and stuff and like gold and silver. Um, yeah, I can pretty much tell. And just by looking at them quickly, there's some weight to In these. my opinion, just by looking at them quickly, there's a possibility that these really are sterling silver. Yeah, they look like this. It's just, you could see the stamp right there, the 925, but like I said, that don't mean anything. I'm not doing this very well. These were 57 cents. And I'll have to test them and let y'all know. But um, if they're real sterling silver, to get sterling silver for 57 cents. Yes, please, I can't find my hole look how cute can you guys even see don't look at me can you guys see how cute those are oh my gosh they're so cute look how cute they are i love them i love them i love them they're they feel so good in my ear i'm gonna leave these in then i got these i'm kind of disappointed in these because i thought these were silver they even look silver in the picture they're called Creative Elegant Mini Exquisite Rhinestone Studs. And I'm gonna show you guys the picture. They were $1.19. They're gold. And it's not like I'm opposed to gold, but a lot of times when you get like inexpensive gold jewelry, it will turn your ear green. And it don't look real. It's like too yellow gold or too bubblegummy gold. And I don't know. These are okay. I'll probably, I might get like a few wears out of them, but silver is more my thing. I don't know. They're really cute though. <laughs> They're so tiny, but they looked silver on the screen. It might just be me or my eyeballs, but you guys can see there, they look silver to me. I don't know. Anyway, they're cute, whatever. They were $1.19. Right. These are called Simple Style Love Earrings. They were $1.07. And they're just little hearts. And if I'm not mistaken, I thought these were stainless steel. That's the reason why I got stainless them. Stainless steel and sterling silver are my thing because they don't turn. If they do tarnish, they're easy to polish with a polishing cloth. And they're very inexpensive, but really high quality jewelry that's very sturdy. So I really like these because these are like little hoops. And when you hoop them, hoop them. When you hook them on your ear, they just look like little hearts in your ear. A uh, dollar seven. I can't remember if I told you guys what that. Okay, was. I got two more pairs of earrings to show you guys and a phone case, and then we are done. And then I have a huge mess to clean up out of my floor. Okay, these come out are more of those earrings that I told you I got. Cause like I said, I want to get like some pieces that I can have all the time and just get rid of all my other stuff that I don't wear anymore. Uh, my mind is getting, as I'm getting older, it's getting um, very overwhelmed with stuff. And the simpler I can keep things, the 
more at ease I feel. So I'm slowly trying to start looking at things in my life that overwhelm me and really getting them down to like this minimalistic like what's the word just be minimalistic with it it's not so crazy i was even noticing with my iphone like my layout and everything and my wallpapers and my backgrounds and stuff when i look at it now i used to love it but now when i look at it i'm just like ah like i want to scream like my mind is in such chaos so I even have to get that down and I'm going to do a what's on my iPhone video for you guys, hopefully really soon, as well as a what's on my iPad. So here's the two pairs of earrings I got. They're called two pieces, um, pair they're titanium steel. So they're good stainless steel. Um, they're just hoops. I got two pairs. They were a dollar 18 each. I got the eight millimeter and the 10 millimeter. And I got them because like I said, the layering up my ear, but they're just little silver hoops that look like that. This one is the 10 mil, mil, millimeter. And then here is the eight millimeter. I don't know if you guys can tell. I'm gonna try to, that's not gonna work, Veronica. So here's the 10, here's the eight. You can see the size difference. Like there's pretty, I don't know if you guys can tell or not. I, I can't hold them right. So there's those. The last phone case is this one. Where's that? This one is called the Premium Silicone Protective Phone Case with something. It's by, if it helps and you want this one, the company that sells this is Rich City. R-I-C-H-C-I-T-Y, all one word. So maybe if you just type in their name, then all the stuff that they sell will come up. But this was $1.48 and this, this sells out quickly. Like I put a notification on my phone for this item for when it to come back in stock, then they will email you or text message you, however you have it set up and let you know. That item is now back in stock if you wanna go buy I'm it. I'm a bit underwhelmed at what it looks like in real life because on, I should have known better. On Timo, it kind of looks like it's glowing, but in real life, it's not. But I'm glad that it's not a sticker, um, but I really like it. It was $1.48, and it just has this really pretty cross on it, and the background is kind of like a grayish lavender color, but that was $1.48. So that's pretty much it, guys. That is my Timu haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, let me know what you've bought from Timu lately. I love Timu. I'm obsessed with Timu and it's going to get me in the trouble. The only thing I'm going to say, and if anybody from Timu watches this video, the one thing that I like about Shein over Timu is that Shein lets you have a wish list. So you can add items to your wish list instead of putting them in your cart. And I like that a lot better because like I said, my mind is... I guess simple and I get overwhelmed with clutter. So when I go into my Timu cart out of all the things that I see and I put in my cart, I want that, I want that, I want that. Hundreds of items, right? When I go to place my order, I have to go through all those items and be like, okay, do I want this? Do I want this? And I'll click it and be like, okay, I want this this time, but I don't want this. So I'll leave that unclicked. And then by the time I get to the bottom of my list, I'm like, okay, what did I order? And I have to scroll through everything, even the stuff that I'm not going to buy at that particular time, instead of just being able to have a wish list, go to my wish list and then click, okay, I want that this time. And then it'll go to my cart. And when I go to my cart to place my order, I can see everything that I'm getting. And it's just the things I'm getting. That's what I wish Timu would do. So Timu, if you see this, please give us a wish list option because that would be great. But I'm going to go ahead and go. I did order a Shein order that should be coming tomorrow it is i think i got three shirts three or four shirts again a couple of rings and one other thing it's a very small it's gonna be a very small haul but it's coming i have what's in my bible bag that i take to work coming i have um some purses that i want to show you guys which will probably be in the Bible video. Um, it all ties together. You'll see when you see the video. Um, what's on my iPhone, what's on my iPad. 
probably another get ready with me. There's videos coming. So, and then the, of course the Shein haul pretty soon. So anyway, I love y'all. I'm gonna go. This video is probably super long, almost an hour. I'm hoping to edit it down. Love y'all. See you guys again soon.